These are the tools I'd recommend you having for uh, building a spout bot. First and foremost, the safety glasses. Make sure you always have safety glasses on and that you wear them throughout the build process. They'll protect your eyes from things that could go flying or uh, anything that might pop up. You, uh, you want to have a soldering iron and uh, you want to have a soldering iron holder. Uh, make sure whenever you're not using the soldering iron, it's in the holder. And always remember to unplug the soldering iron. It's going to allow you to melt the solder and make connections, electrical connections. Uh, this is our wire strippers. It's going to allow you to strip a little bit of insulation off wires so you can take the wire like this and just clean off the insulation there and that'll let you make a nice electrical connection. Make sure your wire strippers will strip wires that are 22 gauge. Uh, then we've got our needle nose pliers here. The needle nose pliers will allow us to bend uh, the wire and make a hook with it like that so we can connect it to different things. We've also got nipper pliers here. With the nipper pliers we can trim off the wire and then with the uh, duckbill pliers here we can uh, bend it and we can also crimp it. Um, so those are different ways we can use the pliers. And then uh, this is a Phillips head screwdriver. We can use that for poking a hole in our bottle caps. And uh, of course we've got our hot glue gun that's going to allow us to melt the hot glue and connect different parts.